Another Valentine's Day has snuck up on us. And for all you hustling, bustling workaholics who forgot to check the calendar, rest assured you can always sprint to the nearest store and pick up a box of chocolates before you head home. Whether you're spending Valentine's with a special someone or you're stuck celebrating Singles Awareness Day, we put together a list of five fascinating chemical facts about why chocolate, in moderation, is good for your mind, body, and soul. Fact, fact one. one. Chocolate is a chemical cocktail of hundreds of compounds, including a group of antioxidants called polyphenols. According to a 2011 article from the American Chemical Society's Journal of Agricultural and Food Chemistry, the natural occurring polyphenols in cocoa, the key ingredient in chocolate, boost levels of HDL, that's the good kind of cholesterol, and they also reduce levels of LDL cholesterol, the bad kind. So chocolate may act as a sort of protective armor against heart disease, but it also is important to note that the beneficial effects of polyphenols don't just stop there. These compounds also contain free radicals, and we're not talking about the Occupy movement here, we're talking about atoms, ions, and molecules with unpaired electrons. Free radicals, which form inside your cells, can affect your DNA in ways that may increase your risk of Alzheimer's disease, cancer, and other diseases. Polyphenols are antioxidants that stop a chemical reaction called oxidation that produce free radicals, and in doing so, they may reduce your risk of these deadly diseases. Back, back to you. Our brains produce a neurotransmitter called anandamide, which can block out feelings of pain and depression. In fact, the name anandamide comes from the Sanskrit word ananda, which means bliss. Awesome, right? Well, only kind of because the effects are short-lived due to the fact that our bodies break this stuff down so quickly. Cocoa contains this amazing compound, but it also has a host of other chemicals that inhibit the breakdown of anandamide, prolonging its blissful effects as well as that smile on your face. Fat, fat, three. Three. Another interesting quality of chocolate is its ability to give you an energy boost. Chocolate contains two very similar stimulants, caffeine and theobromine, which both have a similar molecular structure. If you just feel run down and tired, keep in mind that chocolate has a little more energy to offer than just from its sugar. So avoid those late night chocolate binges if you want a good night's rest. Fat, fat, oh. Cocoa contains polyphenols called catechins, which have anti-clotting and anti-inflammatory effects that could be helpful in preventing certain kinds of strokes. Fat, fat, fat. Fat. A study published in the American Chemical Society's Journal of Proteome Research reported that consuming about an ounce and a half of dark chocolate a day for two weeks reduced levels of stress hormones in anxious people. Scientists found lower levels of the stress hormone cortisol and other chemical indicators of anxiety in the urine of those who ate dark chocolate. So if you're feeling a little anxious, you might actually find some relief in a bar of dark chocolate. But keep in mind, chocolate is high in sugar, calories, and saturated fat. And there are other rich dietary sources for these healthful polyphenols, including fruits and vegetables. But for Valentine's Day, in moderation, with the lush taste and texture, there are a lot of perks to eating chocolate. It seems that the more that chocolate is studied, the more of its benefits are revealed. So for those of you out there looking at chocolate for relief on Singles Awareness Day, or for reinforcement on Valentine's Day, now you have the chemistry to back it up.